for this year's OMK Presidential Recognition Award presented by OMGA President Duffy McNally. On April 22, 2013, James Posto made a sudden and unexpected exit from this world. He became a paramedic in 1998. James initially went to work for Grove EMS and then airing back as a flight medic. He decided in 2003 to take his skills to the big city and he had started his career with IMSA in Tulsa. James spent nine years at IMSA. During his time, he received the Star of Life Award for expertise in heroic actions. And he always went above and beyond the basic call of duty. James, James had a zest for life and was an infectious, happy, open, always willing to help his friends and his fellow employees. Soon after starting with him, so he was considered by several of his co-workers his true family. James was promoted to field operations supervisor in 2010. He was considered one of the best teachers and preceptors within the IMSA system. He was regarded by students as not only knowledgeable, but approachable, confident, and inspiring. He spoke very highly of his partners and had a long request of medics that wanted to work with him instead of the person they were stuck with. <laughs> Throughout the years, his wish to have a career with flight medics grew stronger and stronger. In late 2012, he applied and, and went to work for MediFlight of Oklahoma. In February is when he finished his uh, training with MediFlight and actually was released for full duty. At the time of his death, he had just completed his internship with, with the Tulsa Life Flight base of Air Methods. In a short career, James accomplished a lifetime of successes in the EMS. His former director stated, I sleep well knowing that James is out there taking care of our citizens and crews within our system. For James's dedication to EMS, President Duffy Malcolm would like to posthumously award James Posto the OMK President's Award for 2013 and present it to James' brother, Kirk. <laughs> 